Hi everyone, Ennio from Ambience here. Uh, just uh, wanted to do um, drop a quick video uh, for uh, let's say fixing some uh, common errors uh, uh, when you want to build the AR template of Explore. Um, the errors are common errors that you can uh, find when building. Um, a generic AR foundation uh, app with uh, Unity uh, 2019. So I leave uh, in the description of the video um, the chapters to, to find the solution of, um, of, the, of the errors. So let's jump into Unity. First of all, um, I'm importing uh, AT Explorer. This, uh, this is an error, uh, a warning. Uh, made by Unity because um, Explore has, um, uh, has a code that works um, for different versions of Unity, so don't be afraid to uh, click I made a backup, go ahead. Okay, so uh, first error. We have enable to update following assemblies. Uh, no problem about this because if we click clear, the error um, uh, disappears. Uh, this error here, uh, the type or, or namespace na management does not exist in the blah, blah, blah. Um, this error will be uh, out for the next version of, of AT Explorer. Uh, to solve this, just go to Window, Packet Manager, and then, and then, okay. Let's search for XR, and then install this uh, package here. Again, uh, this error uh, will go will disappear in the next version of AT Explorer. Okay, so first error solved. Uh, so now uh, you can see the tools uh, menu here. Let's open up AT Explorer. Uh, we are going to build an augmented reality presentation for Android. So let's go in the kitchen scene. Okay, so uh, the second problem here is that uh, the, um, the scene has been uh, uh, created for built in render pipeline. Of course, if you are building a project from scratch uh, using URP, you don't have this problem. But uh, the, the, the problem is that um, all the shaders of this scene are standard shader. The standard shader is uh, a shader that works uh, with the built-in render pipeline, but uh, this shader doesn't work in the URP, in the universal render pipeline. To fix this, you can uh, go to Edit, Render Pipeline, Universal Render Pipeline, Upgrade Project uh, Materials, Proceed, and boom. And here we are. So the scene is uh, fixed. Okay, so let's proceed. We want to uh, create an AR uh, presentation for this uh, scene here so let's go to the explore panel uh, build and let's switch to Android AR apply template <clears throat> okay so we switch the to the AR template and uh, let's see if everything is uh, okay with this. Okay, first of all, uh, in the scene tab, uh, if we select the AR template on both uh, uh, Android and iOS, 
you can see uh, another button here uh, add AR marker and this button adds this uh, object that will be the uh, reference of the, uh, the the connection point between the AR um, 3d model and uh, the real world and we can put it on the floor then what we need to uh, to check okay. let's let's build the application directly and see uh, what are the uh, problems that we need to uh, solve okay so uh, file build settings we can remove the sample scene and add the, the uh, open it scene, open scenes. Let's see. We can select the device. Build and run. We can choose where to save the APK file. Save. Okay. Please set the package name in the player settings. The must uh, the the value must uh, blah 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 okay first error player settings we need to set the package name com dot ambience vr dot urp this is the the package name build a run. okay we need to set it here okay build the run again mm -hmm. oh. the problem is the point in the name of the project i think Okay, let's see. Build the run. Okay, uh, the the build um, has been uh, successful, but uh, first error when I uh, test the the app uh, on the phone, there's no AR support. Uh, to fix this. Let's go to player settings, XR plugin management, Android, initialize XR on startup, and then select AR core. Perfect. Now, let's try again. Here we are. Build field exception. AR core required apps uh, required apps require minimum SDK of 24. Let's go. Player settings. Minimum API level 24. Okay. Let's clear. Build the run. Here we are build failed again so uh, you have enabled the vulcan graphic api which is not supported by ar core let's fix it by going here vulcan api and remove okay so we remove the um, the vulcan api let's try again the build Yes. Here we are. Gradle, Gradle update required. AR core requires at least Gradle version blah blah blah. Visit blah blah blah. Okay. Cancel the uh, build. And this is an, another error. AR core requires at least Gradle version uh, 5.6.4. 
before. This is an error um, that will only occur in uh, Unity 2019 uh, because in 2020 uh, they updated the Gradle. Uh, to fix this, let's go here. I leave the link of this uh, in the description. We need to um, download uh, the Gradle uh, build tool. then we can put this uh, into let's say we can take this folder here and put it into a folder on your disk then let's go here and copy this folder and then we need to go into edit preferences external tools gradle and paste the uh, folder here okay and then in the project settings go file with settings project settings publishing settings custom main gradle template custom launcher gradle template custom main gradle template custom launcher gradle template this option will create uh, two files here and here and we need to copy this and paste uh, into the top of the file so let's see plugins Android launcher and main we can open it up with Visual Studio Code for example or Visual Studio paste and here paste okay. let's try again build and run yes So the build uh, is complete. 99% um, the build will be will fail again in the installation phase because uh, <laughs> install failed. It's sufficient storage because my phone is full. This is one error that uh, can also happen. Okay. Um, so uh, another error that uh, can occur with this uh, yard template which I uh, <coughs> which uh, I need to uh, say it again that is uh, currently in beta is that uh, the AR starts correctly but um, it cannot recognize the marker uh, in the real world this can happen and uh, we can apply the template again okay so uh, we applied the, uh, the template again and uh, to double check that everything is fine we need to check here scripting defined symbols uh, it needs to contain uh, this um, string ATE AR and now we can uh, uh, build and test the AR uh, correctly after after all these steps 
uh, it uh, can happen that uh, the application uh, crashes on uh, startup. Uh, to fix this, we need to uh, switch switch this to this one, enable this one, and then we need this. Okay, enabled. Then another uh, common problem. Uh, that you can find but only using URP is that um, the application runs fine but the screen is completely black to fix this we need to uh, edit the universal uh, render pipeline asset and you can find the asset going here graphics clicking here and then you need to um, select the render list, renderer list, forward render, add render feature, AR background renderer feature, and enable the uh, renderer. And then we can build again the application and everything should work.